out. All right, this is exciting, and I love this set that Justin brought in for us from Ooh. Food and Wine. Ooh, look at that. Look at that. A in little a, citrus cake for you. In a skillet. You. In a skillet, look at this. This, this cake came, came out, out of this of pan. <laughs> Think <laughs> plain, about this. I'm plain easier. What you're gonna get, and actually let me show you, because you're getting two pieces, right? You're gonna get, well, you get three pieces, because one piece has a lid. But you're gonna get the eight inch fry pan, you're gonna get the 12 inch everything pan or the paella pan and it does come with its own lid so those three workhorse pieces that you're going to use in the kitchen every single day now if you do need a full set of cookware we have a 13 piece wear set coming up later on today but if you just need your these are your basics these are your everyday basics this is the way you go but they are so far from basic it's it's not even funny okay let's i see you've got the steaks going oh, already yeah. check this out Oh, mama, <laughs> look at this beautiful Ooh, nice. steak. And you know, what I want to point out here is we're cooking in stainless because stainless is the workhorse of a kitchen. Okay. That's why it's been used in professional kitchens for so long. But at Food & Wine, we've tested so many pieces of bakeware mm -hmm. throughout our time in our 40 years, in my almost nine years now, yeah. that we've discovered the best that needs to go into it. Stainless is one of them. Number two, you definitely want a copper bottom because there, nothing conducts heat better than copper, other than gold or silver, but we all know we're not <laughs> cooking in gold or silver. <laughs> we're cooking in copper. And then, to make it even better, we've put an aluminum core. Mm -hmm. So we've got the stainless, the aluminum, and we have the copper. The three of those things together give you this incredible crust. Wow. I mean, we use stainless steel because it's easy to clean. Mm -hmm. uh, we have the tri-ply copper base, which we're in love with. Yeah. Um, it's compatible on a variety of stoves, but yeah. best of all, it can go into the oven up to 450 degrees. Yes. I mean, what beautiful cookware can do that? And it has a double riveted handle, which is really, really durable, as you know. Mm -hmm. um, and then, you know, of course, one thing I love to point out is not only does it go in the oven, yeah. but it goes to the table because it's so incredibly beautiful. Look at that bottom. Look at this. Look at this. You could take this straight from here, straight to the table, and it's a beautiful way to serve. And, you know, when it comes to food and wine and everything, the offering that they brought to us, they have thought of everything from the way that we cook to the things that we cook in it to the way that we then serve and then finally clean up. And you can mm -hmm. do it so simply in this set. I'll tell you, when I was first starting out and it was just me, these were the two pieces that I needed. I wished I'd had them then. You know, maybe for you, you've gone through a lot of different cookware and a lot of different, this doesn't work, this warped, this scratched, this did a hundred different, you know, things wrong. You're gonna love these two pieces. And I don't care if you have, if it's just you in the house, or if you have eight people living in the house and everybody's hungry all the time, you're gonna use these no matter what. Oh, you're gonna use them all the time. Mm -hmm. And I love the fact that um, that you, all the things that you mentioned about how it goes from here to there to the other place, mm -hmm. because you can do things like this. So you can do a paella. Fun. So here we have a beautiful, deli I mean, this is not paella, this is chicken um, arroz con pollo. Uh -huh. this is, so this is arroz con pollo, which mm -hmm. you know, a classic dish. Mm -hmm. and. You make it on the stove, you pop it in the oven to finish, you bring it to the table. Once it's all scooped out and eaten all that deliciousness, you throw it in the dishwasher. And that's it. It's super in, easy. Wait, in the dishwasher? You can put it in the dishwasher. Oh my gosh. <laughs> because, I mean, nowadays, who wants to I know. You know, stand on the stove here? That's right. Okay, that makes it even better. I know. I mean, that makes it even better. There and, are a lot of different kinds of pans that you can't do that with. And of course we have, let's talk about capacity here, because we were okay. talking about this before we went on air, about the incredible wow. versatility of this everything pan. And look at this here. We roasted two chickens oh in our gosh. everything pan. Over here we have arroz con pollo. Over here we have two whole chickens. This is enough to feed wow. four, this is enough to feed eight people. Really? This is because these are big chickens. These are like five and a half pound chickens. Oh my God. And the vegetables that you have in is not just the chicken taking up it's the pan. It's not just the chicken. You've got the vegetables that you've got going around and you can take this straight oh man. to the table. Straight. I mean, it's just gorgeous like that. And we're talking wow. about capacity here. I mean, look yeah. at this. Oh, wow. I'm actually afraid to take this out. I have this platter here. <laughs> I was going to put it on. Oh my God. Let's see how much we can fit just on this platter. I, I wonder how many boxes. <laughs> 
I of, mean, of macaroni that was. I mean, I don't even know, but I'm stopping there because this pan holds too much wow. for that platter. Look at that. Wow. And it's nice and bubbly and delicious. I'm going to give you a little bit. Well, oh, please. Thank it's you. really hot and really cheesy, so just okay. be careful there. I mean, this is the thing. It's 12 inches, but do you see how deep it is? Do you see how much it holds? Do you see from, from macaroni and cheese, and I don't know how many boxes of pasta that was, to your arroz con pollo with all of the vegetables and the, and the chicken and the, um, and the rice there, and the juice. I mean, this is, isn't dried out. This isn't spilling over. It's beautiful. And then your roasted chickens and oh wow, what do we and have here? You get your loaded hash browns in the oh morning or breakfast or lunch or, or afternoon. Right. <laughs> <laughs> or midnight snack. <laughs> like literally all we did, and check this out. I ha I know I have a wet towel here. I just mm -hmm. want to show you. Mm -hmm. So we made these hash browns right in the, you know, eight-inch skillet. Okay. Popped in the oven. And with just a simple wipe, mm. I mean obviously I'm using a wet towel, you're gonna rinse it out in your sink. Right. Look you how clean how, that is. You see how that can easily come clean? I think people are afraid of stainless steel, but I think it's just because they're not using it right. I think so too. I mean, you just cook, you, it is a workhorse. Mm -hmm. And it's been that way for, for generations mm -hmm. and chefs have been using it because of that. Okay, and this is, and, and I'm glad that you showed that because it just goes to show you don't have to be afraid of it. Stainless, I mean, um, nonstick is, is great. But if that's the only reason you haven't picked up stainless steel, if that's the only thing that's keeping you away from your food and wine set, I want you to try it out. Justin's now gonna show you not only how to deglaze <laughs> and get all of those yummy bits right there. I don't know why I'm using cleaning. this towel because we have our stay cool <laughs> handles here. Right. I'm just so used as a professional cook, I'm so used to always wanting to grab pans with a, with a towel, you know, but mm -hmm. we have these beautiful Stay cool handles. There's mm -hmm. enough room to put even my yeah. um, masculine hands in there. <laughs> um, but the, I, so we cooked our steaks. You know, this is how a classic red wine sauce comes together. You notice I'm putting red wine into my mm -hmm. into beautiful carafe. red carafe. Yeah. <laughs> um, so you just pop it right into your, you know, your pan here. Mm -hmm. And because we're using stainless steel, mm -hmm. we can actually use metal wow. utensils <laughs> in our metal pan. Okay. Because, it's a whole new world. <laughs> right, and believe it or not, one of the crazy things is people think that, oh, let's do nonstick because it's so easy to, it's so easy to use and clean, but believe it or not, you actually are not supposed to put wine into nonstick pans. I didn't know that. Yeah, because the, the acidity of the wine can actually um, kind of break down the, the, the nonstick coating. Wow. But because, and this is why, this is why we wanted to ensure that we used um, stainless steel when we developed this product line was because mm -hmm. you always want to cook with wine. We are a food and wine magazine here. Right. And do you see how all of, all of the bits that were there have just come up? You know, you, you leave the pan hot. If you do have anything stuck there, you leave the pan hot, you put your water in, you kind of um, kind of scrub it around and it comes clean. I've cooked totally with stainless steel clean. for years and I actually love it. I love that it's beautiful. I love that it's durable. Never had a problem with it. And you're gonna be the same way with this. So I see you added some butter there. I added a little butter here. 